I'm on a quest to find the best D1 college basketball experience in Massachusetts, so I found myself in North Andover to watch the Merrimack College Warriors take on D1 newcomers Lemoyne College Dolphins in a Northeast Conference matchup. We're checking out the basketball court today, and we're checking out the hockey rink in two weeks, so make sure you stay tuned for that one. There's parking all around the campus, and we got there after it started to fill out, so we did have to walk a little bit, but it's going to get a 7 out of 10. There was nothing special about it, there was nothing too bad about it. To get to the court, you have to drive through Merrimack's campus, which is pretty nice, it feels pretty modern, at least from the outside, so it's going to get a 7 out of 10. The lobby was nice, it had an Athletics Hall of Fame and trophies, and the hockey rink was right next to it, basketball court off to the right. It did feel fairly empty in the lobby, but there were enough people to really fill the space, so it's going to get a 7 out of 10. The stadium itself was a standard gym, it had a Jumbotron to one side which had the game feed on it, the actual scoreboard was off to the other side. It was a nice court though, it's going to get a 6 out of 10. The player intros were kind of boring, there's only so much that a guy with a microphone can do in a gymnasium, so they're going to get a 3 out of 10. I actually really liked Merrimack's jerseys, and Lemoyne's were pretty cool too, so they're going to get an 8 out of 10. The atmosphere was great inside Hamill, the fans were going nuts for the Mac. Every shot got a great reaction from the crowd in the gym. For an attendance on a Saturday afternoon, it was pretty good, so it's going to get an 8 out of 10. I will say there was no distinct student section because it felt like the entire stadium was students. Probably 70% of the crowd was the student body, which is pretty impressive. They had a cheer team and a dance team, but no band, so they're going to get a 7 out of 10. The seating was a standard bleacher bench, 6 out of 10. And the concessions were, in a word, expensive. I got a Gatorade and a Reese's Pieces for $10. There was no sign for the prices anywhere. They had their own beer called Mac Attack, which was, in my buddy's words, Yeah, it tastes like Bud Light. So the concessions are going to get a 3 out of 10. Lemoyne's offense stagnated in the second half as only one player, AJ Dantzler, would top 10 points as the Warriors grab a 66-50 win behind the offense of Brian Atunmu, Adam Clark, Jordan Durkak, and a solid 3-point shooting outage from Devon Savage. All in all, Merrimack's Hamill Court is going to get a 62 out of 100. Check out the rest of the videos in the series on my channel, and I'll see you guys next time.